Augsburg plus 160, Frankfurt plus 155 tells you everything you need to know about this game. Draw plus 250. I don't know anybody that looks forward to betting in Augsburg's games. And there we go. Why have they not just said 2.75? Because the number's at 2.5 and, and it's minus 135. The draw's got to be a runner at plus 250. Frankfurt, draw no bet. This is a very strange game, so I'm going to need some help from the chat. But Stint, you can go first on this one. Augsburg, Frankfurt. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to try and second guess who wins. I think it's quite tricky. Um, even at the odds, we think about well, Augsburg. They started the season poorly, sacked their manager, new manager come in, and they steadied the ship a little bit. Frankfurt, we know, started the season. Um, they were trying to transition from having lost their, their front line, Moani, Kamada, Jesper Lindstrom. And they, they weren't scoring goals, but they weren't crucially weren't conceding either, which has, has helped them stabilise in the in the top half of the table. And now they are finding the back of the net and they're picking up victories. Uh, Omar Mamouche is uh, contributing um, where where Muani left off essentially. Um, but yeah, looking at the the goal line as you mentioned, two point five. Is, is there anyone that wants to back unders now in Frankfurt games? I, I tried it and I was uh, massively found out when there were six goals against <laughs> against Dortmund. And since then, eight eight of their nine have seen overs and across uh, Bundesliga in Europe. So, uh, as I say, in front of goal, they just seem to have found their feet now. And, and that's what happens sometimes when you have youthful replacements. And that's what what they invested in there. They can be inconsistent. But, you know, I think they must they're probably licking their lips at a trip to Augsburg. Um, Augsburg's 12 matches in the Bundesliga this season have seen 45 goals. You know that's almost four a game, and we want to we want to see just three. Um, Ten of Augsburg's last 15 have gone over 2.5, so that's across the the new both the new manager and the old manager. So, yep, again happy to back overs at, at uh, minus 135. But again, if the line was say 2.75, I'd be happy to back that. Or if you want a bigger price, go for the Alex Classic and both teams are scoring. And overs, but as the line set at 2.5, I'm just going to not complicate it. And obviously that helps me with uh, keeping on side any clean sheets, but still seeing three goals. It's a blind play. It is a blind yeah, play. Yeah. It's almost like my I, I was being sectioned for trying to go under in the <laughs> Mines freiburg game. Uh, you just cannot do it. And whenever you get 2.5, because we see 3.5, we see 4, we see 3.25, Alex. When you see a 2.5, it's almost like an alarm goes off. It's almost like uh, Alexa at your home says, you, you, it, there's a number in the Bundesliga that says 2.5. We don't see it. Flash, sorry, yep. just, to, just to finish, the average this season in the Bundesliga is 3.51 goals per game. So yeah. if you use that as initial input, over 2.5 goals as a template would be minus 208. And, you know, it's minus 135. So. And Augsburg, Augsburg, on their own, they've been like crazy. They have been absolutely crazy, home or away, and now they're home. Um, but the plus 160 Augsburg, plus 155 Frankfurt, this could be another one of them 2-2 two, two draws. And I know I say that quite often, but I think that both of these could score twice, Alex. And Augsburg uh, has uh, struggles to, to keep clean sheets here. Yeah. Even though I was reading uh, some stats earlier and imagine that uh, ahead of this match day, no side has attempted fewer shows than Eintracht Frankfurt <laughs> in 12 games, uh, 127. <laughs> that means that uh, it's uh, 10 shots plus per game, which tells you enough about what Bundesliga is all about. If, if Eintracht Frankfurt has 125 shots in 12 games and has the fewer shots across the board from all the teams, that tells you why the 3.51 um on the average goals uh, per per game in the in the Bundesliga is so achievable yeah, I mean, I was with Frankfurt early part of the season. I think they were unbeaten in their first five or six games, but didn't look like winning any of them uh and as for Marmou, she's the most he keep he does score. But he's the most unconvincing striker. I think he's surprised when they actually go in as well. But Augsburg, <laughs> they don't care. They'll have they listen. They, they could lose five one. They could lose four one. But they could also win four three. Uh, it's a crazy old game. But the number of two and a half, we don't see it very often. And it's one of those where you just have to play it just on the number. Um, I'm just looking here. OK, you'll save them questions for when we get to the Q&A. First of all, we'll do the, uh, the official pick. 
because it's over two and a half at minus 105, which is a pure mathematical play, to be honest. <laughs>